Hey guys, Technoverse here. Today we are going to be in Simplify 3D and I'm going to show you how to do these support systems. So we're just going to bring in a model, drop it in, get it nicely in view here. And then once it's selected, all we have to do is click this little support tab over here. I have my overhang angle set to 60 degrees because I know that's what my Ender 3 can do. Originally it was set to 40. Uh, if I leave this how it is, let's change this back to default and generate settings, uh, it'll generate automatically based on that overhang. And then I can go in and if I don't want this one, remove individually each support. I can also add a new support structure if I'm worried that it's not gonna support some place that I think needs support just by clicking. And you can also support only the places that you wanna support. Um, and you, the way that you do that is you click below them and it raises a pillar up to it, whether it's in the model or on the build plate. So it works pretty well. Um, you can adjust the size and put in multiple sizes of support structures as well. So um, that's basically it for the supports. Um, from platform only will make it so you can't put supports on top of your model like this. It'll only work from the build plate. Uh, support settings are pretty straightforward. I would increase your angle, especially if you're working with an Ender 3. I know the TiVo Tarantula Pro also does 60, 65 plus, so this is a good starting point. Um, support resolution is dependent on you. The smaller the resolution, the easier it's going to be to remove from the model, and the less you're going to notice it was there. But at the same time, the less support it's actually going to give. So uh, you have a lot of options to play around with. That's going to be it, guys. Don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button. We'll have more tutorial videos on Simplify 3D coming up in the future. Thanks for stopping by. As always, this channel is brought to you by these fine Patreon supporters. If you'd like to support the channel on Patreon, head over to www.patreon.com slash technivorous. All right, guys, that's going to be the end of this video. As always, thank you. I'll put a video up right here that you can check out for more of our stuff. And if you're still here and you haven't already, why don't you click right here and subscribe to the channel.